Dozy, 3-0, we've had to come beyond there at the end. Were you happy with what you saw? I thought for the majority of the game, the, the boys played to the right style, the right concepts. In particular, I thought our playing out from the back was much, much better today the, uh, from Harry. Right the way through to the, the back four, everyone looked comfortable on, on the ball and we played out really well today. Uh, first half in particular, I thought we looked good in possession, looked good going forward. On the negative side of things, the lads need to work on the 1v1 defending and defending as a unit because too many times people can just walk through as easily and um, the players need to learn how to defend um, individually and collectively. Uh, but it's something to work on, but on the ball I thought thought they looked comfortable today. It was end to end, is that what you like to see or would you prefer a game which you know the two teams defending tighter? Well, I thought the first fifteen minutes of the second half when we conceded the goal, I thought our our play in the transition, we lost the ball again too easily and it allowed them to get a little bit of dominance of the ball and it, it turned into a, a quick NVN game. But then after that I thought we controlled the possession a little bit more with the last twenty five minutes and that's what I want the boys to learn how to do, how to control the game by keeping possession of the ball, switching the play when possible and, and wearing teams down and we did eventually and we got our goal. Yeah, I mean it says a lot about the lads' character to come back from the goal behind and even still go for the winner as well. Yeah, yeah. I mean it's good character to do that but they need to learn how to stop it happening in the first place because over the past few weeks now we've conceded a few too many easy goals. We've conceded another three goals today, and, and again, I think the three goals that the opposition haven't really had to work for. They're not well created goals, and I feel that every time we score a goal, it's all created, and we work hard for it. But we give easy goals away, and we need to work on them. We yet to win in the league since the Fleetwood game on the opening day. Is, that, is there any concerns there about that we're not picking up the three points more often enough? I think if we weren't performing, yeah, I think there would be worry there, but. But we're playing the right way, we're, we're playing well, there's just a few little things they need to tweak and I mean we played up against some of the strongest, supposedly the strongest teams in the league and we've more than matched them and if anything if we'd have been a little bit better we'd have won the games. Two goals for Josh Ginelli today, adding to the four he got in midweek, how, how important are his goals to the team? Josh is doing really well and the most pleasing thing about Josh is he had, had his first team debut a couple of weeks ago now and he, he hasn't changed his attitude within the setup of the 18s. If anything, he's stepped it up and I think some of the criticism of young players who go with the first team is they become a bit too... they think they're a little bit too big for that team and Josh hasn't. Josh has looked at it as to say I need to be the best player every week and, and to be fair, he's there or thereabouts all the time. Accrington home next Saturday. What do you say to the lads now? Just can, can we get back to winning ways? It's development again and we just work week by week and we'll work on a few of the flaws that we had today and we'll also work on the, the strengths as well and, and we keep going Tuesday to Friday and prepare for the game. 